Bells are straw now, fodder to more than just farm animals. A vital ingredient in a new biofuel. According to energy company Shell, waste straw, corn stalks and corn cobs can now be successfully converted into a working alternative fossil fuel. The company is collaborating with developer Logan Energy Corporation in Canada. The process uses an enzyme to convert the waste straw into sugar. This is fermented to produce beer, which is then distilled into pure alcohol, the ethanol. This is then mixed with gasoline to produce a transportation fuel. According to Shell, the mix cuts carbon emissions of vehicles by up to 90%. It wants to promote the idea to demonstrate what's possible in the future. The company is working closely with governments around the world to make large-scale production of advanced biofuels an economic reality. All those involved say it's a win-win situation. The key difference between cellulosic ethanol and traditional ethanol is in how it's made. It's actually the same chemical, but it's made in a very different way. We only use renewable resources in the process, and we're primarily working with materials that are otherwise wastes. So we're taking something that now is left in farmers' fields to rot, and we're making a new fuel that can be used in today's cars. Shell believes biofuels could grow from just 1% of the world's transport fuel mix at present to as much as 10% over the next few decades. New fuels, new ideas and new choices, all aimed at improving the environment and giving motorists increasing energy alternatives.